<laughs> All right, so we have my, my friend here who was a miner, but now he's leaving the mines to go up on steel buildings, right? Yeah. And he's a great guy. We've taken out a few life pomas before. He's got three more. It's almost like a bowling ball. You got the three all together like that. Yeah. And we're going to take him out right now. We are good. Okay, here we go. How's your kids to study at home doing? It's going all right. They're done yeah. though. They're over it. They don't want to do it anymore. They don't. No. What grades are they in? So we got one is seven, seventh, fifth, and first grade. They're over all the homework online stuff. They're done. Oh man, that's in some ways you're close to me. I am. Uh, I got a. Uh, Sixth grader, fifth grader, third grader, and kindergarten. Yeah. Preschool, kindergarten. And how are they doing? I don't know. I think they're doing okay. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. They haven't told me they're done yet, so. They're just more ready. They're they're just upset they're missing out on all the fun after end of school stuff. I know. What a bummer. Yeah. I mean, they're doing pretty good. They're doing all the classes. They're getting all their work done. So. Yeah. But they're just missing yeah. my friends more than anything, I think. Yeah, you really just can't go out and and be with friends. Okay, I'm trying to keep this from oozing. <laughs> so I'm using a little heat cautery right there. All right, so, Jen, I'll have you kind of dab those two. So you got the path for those. I will give you those, please. Here is this one. That hurt? No. Nope. Oh, good. The numbing Not works. Not at all. Bless you, numbing medicine. Right? Ugh. So what was like, it seems like, so the mine you were working at, what, what was, remind me what was like the top things you were mining? Uh, mainly gold is what we're going okay. after. Okay. I'm putting your shades over here. Yeah, thanks. Do you watch Gold Rush? No, I try. I watched a couple episodes and then it's all pretty Hollywood. It's yeah. It's kind of lame. Yeah. Plus, you're... We're underground. You're, you're underground. Yeah, surface is a completely different animal. Yeah, yeah. Underground's way more fun. Do you... So you're finding, like... Are you... So tell me how it works. Well, how it works is they have the geologists. Usually they do some exploration drilling. Yeah. And they find where it's at, and then you we got to mine to it. I see. So if you can picture, like, the way an ant farm works, all these tunnels going every way. Uh-huh. And then... What the exploration drills do is they locate it and then they come up with a plan as far as the best way to get try to, to get to the ore. For the least amount possible. Exactly. Cause How deep are they? Oh, it, it's all over the place. It's, it's always, it's up and down. I mean, it, it's, that mine in particular was a couple miles deep. Wow. So, it's quite a bit. Is it uh, pretty visible? We were talking big, like... Ore. Underground, the ore? Yeah, the big... Like, are you able to see gold? Yes. No. None of it... It's, you, it's, it's all... They crush it up and then get yeah, it extracted? I, yep. It all gets hauled out and then gets goes to a plant, and then they go ahead and they 
you know, they do their all their is mad that, scientist stuff to is it. Is it washed? Or how do they do it? They crush it up and they extract it with chemicals and okay. it gets all it's just a huge process to it. Yeah. Way above my pay grade. Yeah, <laughs> that's cool. We just go find we just go dig it up and take it to them. When did you uh when did you start doing that? I did I started about twelve years ago. Oh dude, you're mm -hmm. you're making a big change. You're doing it a while, right? And then I'll go do something different. Yeah. I know that people are like taking that those gold from like computer parts and stuff. From yeah, like, phones are huge. Like one mine up in Alaska. That's all we did was f we pulled gold out was just for phones. Because huh. it was a Chinese company that or Japanese company that owned them. That bought the mine. They they, just they owned the mine just so they could get just so they could produce their electronic stuff. Huh. That was the only gold that, so that they like, used. Huh. Interesting. Mm -hmm. I mean, you just don't think about that you're carrying gold in your pocket when you open your right? phone. Right? Yeah, you don't. But gold's a good conductor. I know conductor. how much my it phone is. costs, so I do know that <laughs> it is. I know that it's that gold is cheaper than. Uh, just kidding. <laughs> okay, we'll see how this one goes. Let me know if it stings or anything. Okay. I really like getting into the mining just because of all the equipment. The equipment was fun. I bet. Equipment's big. The machinery's just, it's just interesting. It's something that's not your normal, typical nine to five job. I bet. So have you been driving up there to that long? So Montana, no, I've been in Montana for about, about five months now. Oh, okay. So you were working in other mines. Yeah, I've been to Alaska, Nevada, Arizona, Montana. Hmm. Always gold or just whatever? A little bit of everything, because they did a little bit here yeah. up at Kennecott, and there they do copper and yeah. a bunch they, of other types It's like of whatever minerals. they can pull out. Exactly, they're like, and that's what hey. a lot of the mines try to do, is they try they're to like, stockpile some different materials. and Because I know there's like some rare metals that are used in phones that... Mm -hmm you get traces of in different these different mines. Yep. So. Yeah, I know up in America, America Fort Canyon, I've, I've been in a few mines up there and they were like looking for silver back in the day. Yeah, silver's huge. And yep. it's, it's kind of interesting to see because like you can see like where they probably hit some kind of vein of, of silver and, and followed it they through. just followed it through. Yep. And, that was know. the, that's what started Park City. The Park City rush was in silver. Uh-huh. Um, Go ahead and dab that. Yeah, when you're chasing veins, that's where it gets dangerous because you can't kind of predict just, what direction and what. Well, it makes it real hard to do any kind of ground support because mm -hmm. you're just chasing the vein wherever it goes. But you're not doing that. No, they do it completely different. They're just now. kind of taking the gold in this area. Yep, they yeah. try. They still will chase the vein, but they'll chase it in a way that they can.